love to say craft steak. Craft steak, MGM. Oh, to set you are clear for landing. because I'm always constantly worrying about should I stick it in my purse? I need to fold it just right so like the inside of my mask might not touch anything that's in my purse that might be contaminated. So this is cool. What did you think of the bread? <laughs> Look at that. We still have the other one though. I think it's delicious. I love the touch of sea salt on it. Hog says he doesn't need any butter on it. It doesn't need any butter on it but I tried it without and it is delicious, but I'm going to try it now a yeah, piece with butter. What's cool is the outside is crispy, mm -hmm. like hard, mm -hmm. and the inside is super soft. Fluffy, yeah. And light and fluffy. Yeah. Uh, almost like that air, air fried or something yeah. like that that we had at Park and GM. But it's very flavorful. Yeah, yeah, the sea salt was a nice touch. All right, so what did you get? I got the bone-in ribeye. Bone-in ribeye. And you got the ladies' portion. The <laughs> lay mignon. Le mignon. And then we shared a side of fingerling potatoes. That's right. So they look like fingers, I'm assuming. So yeah, that's gonna be enough for us for yep. sure. We figured might as well get the same thing we got out on the own. And then just compare. To see, yeah, what we think. I might take over your onion. And I know you were talking about the price, but I know on the Amo, I got the bigger portion. Yeah. It wasn't eight ounce, oh. this is eight ounce. Yeah, but you're, I, I'm right about your price, because you got the bigger portion. So they're comparable in price, yeah. for sure. So we're gonna try to taste it. Am I supposed to transfer it over? Like the whole thing, or just like a piece? Hmm, that's a good question. I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna transfer it over. That's a real good question. Let me use the juices. Yeah, the juices. Right? What if? What if? Oh god, it's gonna be hot. No? No. Right. Ma'am, we don't do that in this restaurant. Personally, these are just like. Yeah. Where'd you come from? The pool? 
Let's try it out. Oh, I got it medium. Oh, your first bites. Oh, we're, we're, we're getting there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Right away. Mm. Okay, so it's medium. Medium, but I'm telling you right now, first bite, Andiamo's is way better. Mm. Okay. Mm. Right. How are yours? I guess you're gonna do the same thing, right? Yeah. Probably gonna go to me, right? Onion, he doesn't eat the onions. No, sorry. Let's get that one. Oh. Ah, there you go. Now you know a little how to do signature. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let, let me see. Design. Let me see your design. Look at that. Look at that. The chef's special. All right, all right, all right. You're not fooling around. You're in a classy place. Oh, yeah. You hold that fork like a five-year-old. Okay. All right. Yeah. It is very soft, easy to chew. It's a different flavor. It's missing that, uh, what was that sauce called? Um. Zip. Zip sauce. That Andiamo's has. Makes a difference. This tastes more like, like the grill kind of a flavor. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's very good. Very good. Like, I, but I it like, doesn't have like, like that nice little but, zing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or zip, if zip you will. Sauce. Yeah, I mean it's good. But yeah, it's good. All right, very let's good. try the potatoes. Cheers. Cheat cheese. Chichis Malgas. Fingerling potatoes. Can't take anywhere. I like them. Yeah? Mm -hmm. I need more something. More salt? I need salt. Salt? No, they're salty enough, I think. They're alright. They're not yeah. the best, but they're alright. Alright. Bon? Appetite. Huh. No, well, I have to try this. Oh. We really, really like it. Very flavorful. Falls apart in your mouth. Um, good cut of meat. Um, and for the price on the strip. Or on the strip. On the strip. It, I think it's a deal. It's beautiful inside here. It is. You're getting a nice meal. But let me tell you. It's, it's good for the price. But if you want to be around the same price, go to Andy. Yeah, take that effort. The quality. The first bite. Is yeah. So it, much yeah. I ordered the exact same thing. I ordered the filet mignon. I ordered the ribeye bone. Yeah. There's no comparison in the taste. Um, yeah, almost is top notch. But the prices are comparable. You can't make it down to downtown. Yeah. Then come here for an affordable steak. It's good. Alright. So it's part of our Super D Gen Sunday, if you will. Um, Janice Bannister is our Super D Gen member that uh, her suggestion was the one that the wheel landed on, which is crafting. She was also so kind enough to send us a $50 gift card yeah. for Craft Steak. And we truly, Super. truly appreciate it, Janice. Appreciate so, it. big shout out to Janice Bannister. 
for the we lovely you. recommendation. When we see you in Vegas, we owe you. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we got you. <laughs> Thank you, Janice. Thank you, Janice. All right, so I got myself some French press coffee. And Mike and I are gonna share this uh, chocolate mousse cake. Yes? Mm -hmm. Very All right. I got my own little piece right here. Right chair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we're on another Super DGN task. But before we move on to that one, well, I just have to say, in, in hindsight, uh, yeah, I don't go to craft steak. If you're gonna have a steak on the strip, do it right, you know? The waiter and the wait staff were wonderful and I tipped them well, I took care of them. But I asked my for my meat to be uh, medium and it was more like medium rare. And more filet mignon? Yeah, it was, uh, so when I, once I got into the center, it wasn't hot at all. It was actually, yeah, cold. Um, I wouldn't say don't go there. Yeah, I mean, try it. There's other, uh, other dishes. You don't know what's happening right now. Might have affected it. You're right. You're right. So, it definitely was tasty, the, the outside part that I got. But, uh, you know, maybe they're having issues. And then we know the menu is, they change it all the time. And then they... It's not their full normal menu. It's, yeah, it's not the full... So again, it's probably just the times right now. Yeah, of course. Okay, now we're on a DGen mission. Super DGen mission. Super DGen mission, mission number two. Or no, number three. Three? Okay. I'm supposed to go check out the M&M's World, or what is it called? Store? M&M's Store and Hershey's. And Hershey's. So first we're going to go to M&M's, and then we'll head up over to Hershey's New
was your experience in Eminem World? It reminded me of work, being at work. Yeah. Just kidding. Um. Felt like being in a shopping mall with kids and drunk parents. Been there, done that. I think if I had kids, yeah, for sure, that's the place I'd take them. But in times like these, I make sure they were wearing masks and not touching everything. Ah, but that's parenting. Yeah. People don't have parents. I'm now. sure not all parents are like that. Nope. But some of the ones that were in there were. Yeah. Ah. Look how majestic. Majestic lion. Yes. Oh, I got COVID. Three right. water in my eye. Oh. <laughs> That's what you think there, buddy. Ah. At least that'll answer a lot of questions. Yeah. Are parents taking their kids to Vegas? Oh yeah, Ace? Ace of Vegas, what do you think of that? Redemption, slap ball, the stolen tea towel. We're going back where it all started. The cosmopolitan. We're going to end it where it all started. We're getting out of this balash. We just used her for her free parking. That's right. And now we're we'll oh. short walk to the cosmo. To the cosmo. That's not. <laughs> All right. Cheese. And away 
away we go. And away we spin. Spin to win. Don't leave the Tito in. Spin in to win. Don't leave that Tito in. Spin in to win. Don't leave that Tito in. All right, so we just finished our redemption virtual pool or whatever. Go big or go home. Pool over. Over at Cosmopolitan. Uh, we ended up with Zilch. But well, that's how we were gonna do it. That's how we we're gonna do we're it. We're gonna go hand pay or we go zero. Yeah, or at least double. We didn't quite get to double. But we had a lot of good bonuses. Uh, so I th it was worth the three hours. It was definitely fun. It was amazing like to last that long. Oh and yeah. We, at least we saw multiple bonuses and good size bonuses. Yeah. So. Yeah. It, it does wipe us out, you know, we try our best to keep up with the chat. We try our best to keep up with what people's input is. Um, we gotta organize it better. We have to organize it better. Um, I will be honest, you know, this was a redemption pool for those that participated on Monday. And a few from one from the ones that uh, ended up with some money left over on our Friday Super Day Jam pool, but um, I just I wanted to make sure they felt like they had uh, some control over what we did, and uh, yeah. So we're walking through Bellagio to get our car to get to the car, and That's we're gonna head back. It's like 11.45 p.m. Oh, I turned my, my battery died. Yeah, so it's like about 11.45 p.m. So we need to head back to the D. It's and packed on a Sunday night. It's packed. The yeah. The signals are jam packed. Really yeah. Was. And in fact, it got more packed the later the, the night. The later it got. So. Uh. The streets, the sidewalks are alright. Yeah, it's like, like inside, inside the casino. Yeah. The streets aren't busy. There's so many DJs playing six to five blackjack. It's crazy. It, it amazes us that they would sit down and play that game. At like $25 a hand. $15, $25 a hand. But it is what it is. Yeah. You know. Yeah, it's all about the so anyway, we'll check back with you once we get to the G. Vegas Vicky as she kicks the door open.
Oh, I can get ice here. We needed another week, I can just say that. Oh my gosh, because we needed to do your thing with the creek. There's so many so many more things to do. The dive bars. Yeah, Ellis Island. There's just a ton more things. There is a ton more things. Collect some more chips. All right, guys. Say goodnight to Las Vegas. It's been fun. But it's got to end sometime. We'll be back October 28-ish. Oh, look. There's some zip liners. COVID missed. Just kidding. We'll be back... We'll be back October 28th, hopefully, for the Circa Black Tie event. Circa opening Black Tie event. By the time you see this, it'll be, you already know we're back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just be leaving, coming back. We'll just be coming back. All right, guys. Good night. <laughs>